were like dancing and whatever, and everybody was like, y'all smell that? <laughs> <laughs> The audition process was actually a very unique one that I don't think has really been used before. But Simon was doing a search for obviously the future ex on TikTok and asked us to put up a video showing our talent with under a hashtag. And so we all did that challenge. And then we got reached out by Simon and his team and got explained the whole um, concept of the future ex. And we started, you know, just coming together. And from there, our whole lives change and nothing has been the same since. <laughs> just from a TikTok, like, it's pretty incredible. I'm like always posting on TikTok, just singing videos and stuff like that. So I was just posting TikToks and I saw the challenge and I was like, why not? I, I want to be next to music. So I used the <laughs> hashtag, I used a contest and then like just went about my normal life. And uh, I got a message from the team at XIX and they were like, can we fly you out for an audition? And I came out and auditioned and it was so surreal. Like I did not expect like any of this and now it's just like we're in a group and it's so much fun. Yeah. <laughs> I was just posting videos like normal and they decided to fly me out to Los Angeles for the first time which was so cool because I've never been and XIX I got to meet the team and I auditioned through a few rounds of the auditions and it went really well and I was so excited when we all got to meet each other and now we're in a group. Yeah. We all met each other mm -hmm. on like the last day of auditions and we didn't even realize it was the last day of auditions and we all got to dance and sing together. And then right there, Simon was like, this is it. And it was super crazy <laughs> because it, you can feel the energy that like yeah. this was the next yeah. group, yeah. which yeah. was insane. During the process of the audition, it was a little bit, not overwhelming, but I think it was very breathtaking to, to, to accept everything that was happening because we we're moving very quickly. So we didn't really have a time to kind of gather ourselves, to take a, a quick second to look at what we're doing. So it was just getting used to being on the go, if that makes sense, and then just, how everything came together, when we got to the end, Simon just was like, all right, this is the group. And like, it was just like, we couldn't really take it in at the time, because we were just like, wait, what? already? <laughs> like what? Like, you know, what? so it was very, it was a very surreal moment. One thing I feel like they will soon get to know about me, um, I am very bubbly. I feel I have like a, I may be older, may be the oldest, but I do have like a, a you know, a kiddish energy, but I always, you know, my child always lives in me. So I always stay, I guess, I young. I love that. Young, <laughs> that, <makes> <laughs> I love that. <laughs> yes. Um, I'm actually a twin. Work, work. Twin. Yes, um, he lives like kind of near San Diego. He's in the Marines right now. And he just came like, I think, last weekend to like come visit the house and everything. And he's like super stoked about like my dreams and like um, everything. So it's so like, so nice to have like a full circle moment with my twin and like us like pursuing like everything we want to do. So it was really nice. I think I have a unique style. Um, I think people will start to learn that about me that I don't like to fit in one specific style. I like to be diverse. So yeah. <laughs> yeah. I would say one thing that fans will be shocked about me is that I love to bake. That's one thing that, very different than the opposite side of dancing, just to chill out and bake and just hang out with them is super fun. <laughs> Something that fans are gonna be able to get to know about me would be that I enjoy photography and it shows through social media. I always love trying new things with different angles and filters. So I'm excited <laughs> for the fans to get to know that. I think something that fans would be shocked to know about me is that I like grew up working on a farm and I really like to fish. Work. Mm -hmm. I think that something fans will soon find out about me is, well, I love cooking all the time. I'm like trying to cook and it's weird now that we have a chef in the house and I can't really get to cook like I used to. I mean, it's amazing. It's like right. living the dream, <laughs> but like, you know, it's, it, has, it doesn't even click yet. And like, I'm always doing handstands. I feel like it's <laughs> an addiction of mine to just do handstands at random moments in time, like even in rehearsal, but yeah. I think that the fans will definitely uh, get to know all of us individually, but also as a group, we are very diverse but um, it's about bringing both worlds of dance and um, singing together. So I think that's one thing that is definitely gonna blow people's minds, how we create both um, worlds and combine them together to make it one, if that makes sense. 
Um, but yeah, I think it's gonna be pretty extraordinary. I'm excited to see how people react because it's never been done before. So Simon definitely was, was up with this one. So. <laughs> yes. Okay, it's got so many. Oh my gosh, I, rem <laughs> yeah, yeah. I remember we were um, in rehearsal and I had like the biggest bowl of cereal like before oh rehearsal, my God. and we were like dancing and whatever, and everybody was like, "Y'all smell that?" <laughs> <laughs> it was me. I was like, "Somebody, somebody let something out." Like, yeah. <laughs> and I was like, "Yeah, who was that?" Like, "Y'all yeah. say," but like, it was definitely me. <laughs> uh, and yeah. that's when we found out he was like just normal tolerant. bodily yeah. function, you know. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, that was definitely embarrassing. Anyway. <laughs> that was so funny. <laughs> Every day Simon brings us a bunch of songs like that we haven't heard before that are possible new singles for the group. And every time that we think we hear the best song, he plays us another that Literally. tops it. And it's every time. pretty incredible to think that we'll be the voices on the tracks. I think the new single that's coming out is one of our most inclusive as a group song. It kind of just like is an anthem. I think it is gonna bring a lot of people together of all types of people. Like it's, um, like I said, it's like an anthem and I think it's gonna be a powerful song for our group to start off with and set a statement. Like right off the bat, I think it's gonna change a lot of people's minds and views of us and that we really are standing for something. 